I'm just impressed with how much it actually looks like chicken. I feel like it tastes like a sausage, like a Lincolnshire sausage. This is what goes on behind the scenes. I'm just tired, tired. Turn around. That is a vibe. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Hello, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I need to get me ban it chopped. Um, but I've got a different kind of video today. I've been watching these to death when I've been procrastinating during finals, and it is the vegan like. Ooh trying like the vegan options at the fast food places so i'm thinking we'll go to kfc burger king and greg's in between i need to get my hair cut at some point but i thought you know it would just be cool to try them all i'm really excited to try the kfc one it's just an excuse for me to eat to be honest um so i did have breakfast actually i didn't really have breakfast i had a ben's cookie and some fruit um and some water so yeah i need to go and eat it's 20 to 3 so we better get a move on to be honest let's go get some kfc mm -mm -mm. if this is i've heard it's really dry so i'm gonna ask for extra mayo hello can i help hi can i have the vegan um chicken burger please Sorry? the vegan chicken burger vegan burger yeah please oh. On its own or a meal? Yeah, just on its own, please. Anything else? That's all, thank you. Thank you, guys. Cheers. Oh, sh I forgot to ask for extra mayo. Hey, so, can I have extra mayo in the vegan burger? Is, is that possible? Sorry. Thank you, sir. I've got the bag, I've got the mother f***ing bag. Oh, I'm not gonna eat. I wanna go where like, people ain't gonna be staring at me. No, I'm not gonna eat. Shit, come on, Abby. Right, that's gonna be the thing gonna be shining there, so. Period. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, yeah, that's what we like a good dollop of mayo. Oh, let's try the mayo on its own. Because I've never had vegan mayo, I don't think. It's very vinegary. But. But let's have a look at the burger, right? It looks dry, I'm not gonna lie. It looks... Um, smells like some fried chicken. Bruh. That is good. That is really nice. It's like... It doesn't taste like... Sorry. It tastes a bit sausagey. It doesn't taste like a normal KFC chicken burger, but it does taste like, you know, like when you go to Marks and Spencer's and you get their seven fried chicken pieces and put that in the oven. That's what this tastes like. I'm just impressed with how much it actually looks like chicken. Mm. You definitely have to ask for extra mayo because I can tell that if you didn't have much mayo in there, it'd be dry. 110% I would get this again. Okay, so the more I've been eating it, it's got a nice little spice to it. But it just tastes like a sausage. I feel like it tastes like a sausage, like a Lincolnshire sausage. That's what it tastes like, a Lincolnshire sausage. You lot are getting bare ASMR <laughs> sounds because of this lapel mic. It's got a really nice aftertaste, but it literally tastes like a sausage. It's got a weight to it. I was expecting it to just be like a sorry piece of corn like you know when it's just it, i didn't think it'd be anything substantial but this is kind of not filling me up because it's just a burger but it's like hitting the spots and if this was a meal well you can't get it a meal actually because you can't get the chips i say if i had this in a corner of the cob or something i'd be satisfied kfc have come through that was good would i get it again yes but it, it's just stupid that you can't get like a fries with it because obviously you're gonna want a meal but Ah, that would hit, that hits the spot. It's as good as I thought it would be. Actually, it's better because it's got a nice little spice, like a peppered spice at the end, which kind of resonates in the palate. It's quite nice. But, um, right, let's go get me hair cut. I had to cheat on my barber and I feel like you can tell. 
I don't know what he's done to my hair, but he has not half butchered it. it looks, I don't know. Look, look at the back, it's all sticking up. I should have just waited till tomorrow when he was back in. I'm so annoyed. Uh, and then to top it off, they say bad things come in threes. So first my barber wasn't in, so I had to see someone else butchered my hair. Then I went to Greg's. They didn't have any vegan steak bakes. So I was like, okay, it's cool. Just go to Burger King. Went to Burger King. They don't have any <laughs> bloody whoppers. So basically this video is an absolute flop an absolute fail so i am gonna just put this in with a vlog i'm gonna do a vlog on saturday today's thursday i'm gonna do a vlog on saturday when i go to london and shoot and stuff so i'm gonna have to put this in with that but it's okay we keep going we keep going it's not the end of the world it's only a pie and burger i'm gonna go home take a shower get ready reassess my life um i did get should i do a little haul i got some really exciting stuff woohoo so firstly i got a travel adapter very exciting next i got some deodorant because i ran out i normally use the mitchum roll on i prefer that that's the best but i couldn't be bothered to walk to boots and so i just went to poundland and it was a quid you can't complain for, for, for a quid then this is my favorite toothpaste um i probably shouldn't have a favorite toothpaste especially because this contains palm oil i'm pretty sure and it also um is well it's a recyclable tube but i don't know if it's all recyclable i really want to get the parlor toothpaste tabs but they are not in stock at the minute when i went to go and order them so i'm waiting for them to get back in stock but anyway this is a really good one this is my favorite oral b toothpaste uh, because it has like mouthwash oh yeah oh it's not i thought it had mouthwash bits in but it doesn't but it just leaves your mouth 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 it leaves your mouth feeling really fresh. It's so good. So now I can only really use this one. Like this morning, because I'm back home with my parents, they just had like normal Colgate Total, which is a good toothpaste. Like it does the job, but it just doesn't leave me with that same feeling. Anyway, then I got this. This was 75p for um, 75p a bottle of shower gel. Just your Imperial Lather. Imperial Lather? Imperial Leather. Awakening Mango and Papaya. This was 75p. This is actually for holiday, but I don't know if I'm going on holiday. I don't know if it's going to get cancelled. This is what goes what goes on behind the scenes. <laughs> what would we do without that? Honestly. Uh, we're just shooting off of Liverpool Street, and we are doing the first outfit. Hey. So I, so I just um, put these glasses on because I wanted to ask Satpal if they suited me and he was like let's film them, uh, let's shoot them and see what they look like and this is what we got. There we go. And Hold on, go on zoom. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a no. <laughs> is a wrap we have finished how many looks four uh, four looks and it took us two hours three two, hours just some two hours which is more likely walking quick. around and waiting <laughs> around <laughs> places to get changed, to get changed. <laughs> pub toilets street corners we're not fussy so i have just been just finished shooting as you would have seen in that last clip i'm just going to meet you we're going to take some photos and then we are going to grab some food and just chill grab a drink most likely so I'm just gonna meet him now. I'm freezing, it's gone really cold. Um, so I'm just gonna go walk and meet him now. I've just come back to East London. No, I've just you come back already? to Jordan. Yeah, we were shooting oh, here Oh, earlier. sorry. And look who I've Hello. Hello. <laughs> Uwen has a channel, Mr. Carrington. I've mentioned it on my channel before, but I'll link his channel down below. Thank, Thank you. you. Check it out for all your Thank DIY you goodness. <laughs> uh, so we're just gonna... <laughs> He's good. Uh, we're just gonna shoot some uh, photos and then we're gonna grab some food. Uh,
turn around. That is a vibe. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I think. So we've just come to Pizza East in uh, Shoreditch and we've come for some pizza and some beer. <laughs> I have gone for the spicy sausage with broccoli and cream and Newark has got the mozzarella with black truffle. Very bougie. 